Hello, hello, and welcome back, you two peeps, to more... Oop, 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 come on, D Dishonored! Uh, just talking with chat about, uh, this and some of their other game, Arcane Studios' other games. Uh, but anyway, when we left off... <clears throat> the High Overseer Campbell leads the city's militant religious faction, and is a close ally to... Al we read this last time. We were... When we left off, we had arrived here in the, uh... The streets of Dunwall. Hold on, this is very loud on my end. In the streets of Dunwall, and we met the insane Granny Rags. Uh, and she said she had a gift for us if we poisoned the gang leader. Or if we went to the gang leader, um, Slackjaw and poisoned his distillery that he's using to make fake medicine. And now I turned it down too quiet. There we go. And we can find the stuff to poison it in there. Some rat guts, apparently. And we're heading to get that. <coughs> Alright. Careful. There, yeah, Pre Prey, Dishonored, and uh, Deathloop are all the same studio. I plan on eventually playing through Prey on the channel, too. We're gonna go into the top balcony. All right, slip through now. Uh, yep, go into his office. Hmm. Anybody up here? Hearing or seeing any people? The bathroom. Excerpt from Natural Philosopher's Notes. The Rat Plague. Over the years, I've studied this cursed plague, collecting and, <coughs> and collecting and dissecting rats by the thousands. Given their rapid gestation and and maturation, I can't say that word right. Cycle. It's been possible to breed them for numerous generations. Drones themselves seem immune to the plague, but they pass sorry, I'm moving around a little. They pass it readily between members of their own species, perhaps through mites. The blood of the rats tell their own, it tells its own story, allowing me to gauge the number of generations that that a given group of rats has lived with the plague. As such, a nagging question remains. The rats collected in the poorest parts of town, in the slums, exhibit the oldest strains of the plague, while those found near the docks, where the, for, the foreign plague-bearing rats would presumably have entered our city, exhibit a young strain of the plague. Could this mean that the rats were transported to the slums in some way that is not obvious? I will continue my research. If nothing else, I am living proof that Sokolov's elixir, er, and Piero's remedy are very effective at protecting against the plague, if one consumes enough of the stuff. So yeah, there's the two different cures competing. One being made by our the resistance member scientist. <clears throat> Galvani. The latest case uh, should arrive within the week, containing all the components you need. Be careful with the white prosperous. Can't have you getting ju uh, getting fossy jaw like the tanner at the edge of the city, poor bastard. Sorry you have to um, to practice in secret. The vivisec the vivisectionist should uh, be celebrated, revered even. Cutting up rats should be done uh, done in the town square with crowds of eager students taking notes, not in some dirty little secret room hidden behind a wall of books. Anyway, lucky for you. Lucky for you to have an old friend who never left the academy. Let me know what else you need. And but remember, it might be a month before I can put together another shipment. Yours in knowledge, at at Termis Moore, procurement clerk and provisioner, Academy of Natural Philosophy, South Wing. P.S. Next time you you're nearby, come in for an afternoon. We've stayed fairly insulated from the plague since the few since so few come and go here. 
And we've got um, quite the stock of Tivian brandy. I don't think we ever visit that. Oh, this. You know, now that I know what I'm looking for, this seems obvious. No. How do I open that? Oh, you have a good night, Tyrant King. Oops, wrong power. Um, I don't think we ever visit the Academy of Natural Philosophy. I think that's another one of those locations that they planned on having the player visit often, but never got around to. Or, or never had the time to put in, I should say. How do I open this? Oh, there we go. I was looking for a lever somewhere else. Rat viscera. Let's pick it up and we'll figure out if we're going to do things with it. I don't think I want to steal from this guy much. Sewer capacity in the month of nets. Ah, oh, we're good without that. I'm not going to read every book like I said. No charms in this house. At the academy, they cut the flesh of the dead and trap the lightning from the sky. Why am I so cold? The great ships have stopped bringing their hulls. What have they done to me? Let's head back out. Yeah. Alright, let's head to Slackjaw's place now that we got the rat viscera. There we go. Come on. Get down there. That's the the guy that we saved from a group of thugs. Bunch of things carved around here, or like. Old paint, or old graffiti, that's the word. Graffiti all over here. And it looks like someone was camping here with some shady shit. Oh, wait. Nate, drop point has changed. Leave it in the sh uh, shitter under the bridge. If the elixir ain't there, you don't get paid. Okay, cool. In the shitter on under the bridge let's pick up some oil whale oil I'm sure Piero can make use of that just some uh, gang smuggling stuff I don't think there's anything wrong with us taking this oh <clears throat> eighth entry it's the fourth day in the mo uh, month of rain. Mirrors is or more, more, Morris is sick, and so are the children. I've avoided it thus far with such good fortune, since it has fallen on, on me to care for them. The city watch comes and goes, knocking on the door and asking for signs of plague. Even our neighbors cannot be trusted. Earlier, it was difficult to keep the children quiet. Now they sleep most of the time. The flies have set in. I tried to keep them away, but I can barely get close. They uh, they sting so. Most of the time, Morris won't answer me when I try and talk, talk to him from across the room. Morris is gone. I don't know what I'll do. For now, all my hope is reserved for the children. Leaving the flat for a while near dawn, I found some plague bag, <coughs> plague bags from the guard. Both while no one was around. It took a while, but I got Morris into one of the bags. At least his face is covered. Young Robert passed away. The star of my sky is gone. Age missing. Ellie stopped breathing in the middle of the night. She was such a headstrong girl. I can hardly believe she was overcome. She was, al she, she was always near as I cut up hagfish vegetables, arguing with me about everything. It's the fourth day of the month of wind. 
It has settled in and they, they are lost to me, all of them. I cannot bring myself to call the dead counter. I have a fever now. No guards co come near anymore. Sad. Children's rhymes. Gaffer's tale. That's fucked up. Oh, wrong direction. Oh, that was just a guard talking to a guard. Hmm, bullets. And this is where Slack draws places, the just the whiskey distillery. <coughs> and if we pull out our heart. There's a bone charm here. There is a strong drink made here. I tried it once. Distilled from river crusts by the taste of it. But the brothels spring up around the distilleries. They are inseparable. That guy down? Be just a boss, like Slackjaw? No, no, no. This is one odd bird. Consorts with crazies, does rituals and the like. Bone charm. by the outside man given dark powers he can slit your throat across the room well that'd give him a leg up for sure it's no coincidence <laughs> that most men won't even whisper his name is it true that he lives in the flooded district with them weepers and wild hounds that's what they say perfect place for a paid killer to hide hmm So we've got an idea of where Dowd might be hiding. Ratchet. Right on the other luck. side of here. When you're this handsome, you don't need luck. Face like a hagfish. Pay up. Don't be sour. Say, when's Slackjaw coming down? It's not till the next there. batch of elixir's done. He'll want to check on things. Then you better get all your shit together, huh? Everything's fine. I run the still like I run a game of Nancy. Yeah. Let's give it a moment and I'm sure. Not fast enough. Oh, he's got a key on him too. Yeah, they're stomping on the rats. Aha. I figured that key would be needed. Oh, but this isn't the way forward. Uh-oh. Don't mind me. Come on. How do I press... Further along, then, if not through there. Oh, there's a door right there. He's walking up this way. No one's looking up. Probably should have used dark vision before stepping through, but luckily, no one was here. Still further off that way. Nice. Uh, Craxton, I'm coming tomorrow to check the booth. Make sure you're wearing pants this time and stick to the recipe. One part soak loves the like skirt. One part beach gum paste, two parts uh, sugar water. That's it. The more uh, the more of the real shit you cut in, the less there is to spread around and less the coin I can make. This ain't a charity, Slackjaw. So yeah, they're making fake elixirs. Not to the Abbey or the office of the High Overseer, but one of the other things. Where they train the overseers to be real religious. Crazy. 
wants to know where his brother is. He sneaks it. You know where it is. Going in at it when he's so I remember. Brimsley job. Hitting the dumbwaiter all night. Yeah. So he goes from room to room. Kids sleeping. An overseer giving a lecture to the kids. Couple guys training with those hounds. Stuff you'd expect. But it gets weird. Some kind of machinery. Then a woman laughing. Just laughing and laughing. Then music. A kind of plinky, plonky sound. That's what spooked him. You sure he wasn't drunk? Mm -hmm. Says he still hears it at night. He never did find his brother. <coughs> Strange. <coughs> Guy right there. Again, I keep taking the risk of walking... Walking through doors without, like, using dark vision to check if it's safe first. Good thing that guy was down there at the time. <coughs> Up there. Take this. Uh, another book on the rat plague. Yeah. Uh, I gotta climb up somewhere else. Oh, oh. <sighs> Come on. Yeah. Fucking fucking barrels. Let it recharge a little. Right there, I can see it. Well, let's check out what that bone charm does. Uh, tough skin. Your max health has been slightly increased. Nice. That's all we can equip for bone charms for now. I don't mind robbing from these guys. Huh? What? What? Uh oh. <sighs> that was close. Attach empty elixir vial, but. No. Yet. Spring razor trap. People they sell to. Great bootleg elixir. Hey, apparently it works just as good as the normal shit. At least for me. Great bootleg elixir. Great bootleg elixir. Great bootleg elixir. Oh no, I can't carry anymore. Hold on, let's drink one of my elixirs so I'm at full health. Oh, we can't just can't make any more. They're out of things. Okay. Uh, I think it'd be a stupid idea to infect a bootleg elixir maker with the fucking plague. Can I just... No, I can't break his elixir maker. Alright. So we're not, we're, we're not gonna fucking destroy the elixir maker. 
The noble blade with the scullery maid, so loudly they made quite a rhyme. The nobleman's wife, the butcher and knight, and carved herself some peace and quiet. <laughs> oh, I get it. The wife done kind of both, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the gist. Now it's your turn. Oh, uh, let me think. Um, okay. Keeping each other entertained. Once was a sailor from Morley, who fancied a woman most sorely. He gave her his cash, she gave him a rash, and that's all. There isn't no Morley. Hmm. <laughs> ah, you win. You win. Well, I know a hundred of his old rhymes. My mummy used to tell him that. I wonder if there's a way I can fit under there eventually. Like I'm pretty sure there's a power that would give me the ability. All right, but yeah, like I said, I'm not going to infect it. Shut up. I think that'd be a little fucked up of a thing to do. So let's just get out of here with our bone charm and elixirs. I wonder if there's anything valuable down there, though. Um... Uh... Uh, looks like some Tivian ore, maybe. A little valuable. Let's see if we can't just snatch a little bit of that up. I don't want to risk him seeing me. Oh, another key. Uh, elixir black market. Yeah, talking about bro, just more lore about how they're stealing or about how they're selling elixir illegally. Is that? Oh god! Oh god! They won't follow me through. I like to pretend I like run through and I knock shit over and like. You know, I just pull out some of these and let the barrels block the door. Because enemies can't follow you from loads until. Oh, oh god. What? Can they? Ooh. Oh my god, they can follow you through a load zone. I always thought people couldn't follow you through load zones in this. Jesus, I've never had that. I've never knew that you could be followed through a load zone. That's terrifying. All right. Let's push on to our next location or to our next destination. Is there more? Yeah, okay. There's a ruin over there. I wish that. See, if I didn't go to the, the distillery district, I wouldn't have known there's a bone charm there. I wish that when there was a region you could go to that had a bone charm in it, that <clears throat> that the heart would like flag up a little symbol there, you know? They got a wall of light there. We've read a bit about those. Let's just well, play see. Is it on? What's it look like? Blow off. Hey. Go on. Oh yeah, they're throwing rats into the wall of light for entertainment. Luckily, I don't need to go through, and I can just go over. Tell me again what you'll do if Slack John and his Bottle Street Boys jump you. <laughs> My father had golden hair. My mother hair like ash. Oh, no. Tibby and Orr in that. AKA Valuables. 
here. And then we'll go up this way. Yeah, the bone charm is in there, or the rune. Oh, Hall Hall Square. Hall Hall whatever the square. Yep. Okay. I like that that there's the statue of an overseer there. They got a siren right there. And that looks like a rewire tool if I want one. Oh, come on. Got you now. Uh oh. Take him. Uh. Hit the arm. Shit. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck. Dump you in the river. To arm. Flank him. Shit. Oh god, that's a lot of guards. Come on, get through the thing. Oh god, I'm I'm fucked. Um lost it. Ow. I'll find you. I hear you here you are. Got you now. Alright, go through the door. Oh, that was rough. That was not good. Alright. Yeah, they can't follow me. Okay. Or maybe it's a certain doors they can't. Enemies can't. Hello, Martin. I hear the second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. Is that true? Or is it the itching that really gets you? Or the rats? Jasper, isn't it? It's not so bad in here, except I miss your wife. <laughs> ha! You don't scare easy, I'll give you that. But that'll change. Psst, Corvo. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do. And I can help. Unlock me, and I'll buy you a drink in a couple of days. <sighs> Feels good to stand up straight. <sighs> Thank you, Corvo. What you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance. We've got to find Emily. So kill Campbell and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal. His notorious black book. And get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kerr now. And word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. If I see Samuel the Boatman, I'll tell him to pick you up in the backyard, behind the office of the High Overseer. Got it. May I... Spirits guide you, and may our enemy's head hit the floor without you taking a scratch. Once, Once they're brought, brought here, they, they never leave. The overseers always find the guild they seek. I was just reading in the archive about the heretic's brand there. It sounds painful. Have you ever seen the ritual? I've never seen the heretic's brand used. No, it's a rare occurrence. But I did spy the face of one so branded. A former member of our order, of course. Out on a retreat, we passed through a fishing town and saw him begging. What were his crimes? Who can say? The brand is reserved for an overseer, or even the high overseer himself, who violates our codes and must be cast out permanently. Remember the seven strictures, 
and you never need worry about such matters. I will, brother. Hmm. <clears throat> Sorry for the blinding light. Come on, how is that not close enough for me to warp onto? Can I stand on this part here? Should we gather for whiskey and cigars Go tonight? Here. Indeed, I believe so. You got a health elixir there. Here we have the High Overseer's office. And we'll press on into there next time. Oof, man, I've been enjoying this game. I'm surprised how long, uh, how much, uh, you know, I never like timed myself playing the game and I never realized how long one mission could actually take in this sometimes. Like, I think this is the, this is the, uh, or, bleh. we're about to be going into the third video on the first non-tutorial mission, <laughs> non-tutorial mission, oh my god, excuse me, I got hiccups all of a sudden, <clears throat> yeah, I hope you've all enjoyed this, um, if you're watching this on YouTube, just yesterday I started a series where I play Minecraft again, as well as, uh, Overcooked with Hero Rareheart again, so you can check out both of those. Uh, also early this week, I started a new series I'm very excited for, uh, <clears throat> Hero Infinite, which is me showing off my, uh, tabletop RPG I've been designing more. So, why don't you go check those things out, huh? Hope you all have a wonderful evening, though. Ta-ta!